Welcome back to Terrible at Fishing. Uh, we're going to talk a little bit about snap swivels. <laughs> Let's watch my new intro. I like it. <laughs> I did the animation on it. Which is kind of cool when you do stuff like that. So, we're going to talk a little bit about BAMs. Now, a lot of fishermen, they don't like these. They think they're kind of like the weak link, you know. You tie, you tie a knot to this, and then this can come undone. Well, let me tell you something. I kind of agree with them on a lot of cases, except I really like this design. You see this little hook? It snaps right in and it holds it. And that gives this so much more strength. Now, why use a swivel? Well, two reasons why a person would want to use a swivel. One, quick exchange between one bait and the next. And two, reduce line twist. Now, when does line twist happen? Well, typically with spinners maybe, but spoons. A spoon will create a lot of line twist. So, actually, when you have a swivel, it allows the bait to do its thing without causing your line to go ahead and, you know, line twist. <laughs> twist. <laughs> so, using, I use these all the time, uh, except, and there is some exceptions. I don't use it for my topwater uh, baits, because I really want, I don't want that that topwater bait to um, rotate. I just want it to run straight. So with topwater and uh, my frogging, those things, they have to uh, be tied directly to my bait. Now, just about everything else, I would love to, I use these. Now, when I use my ultralight, you know, I'm dealing with four pound test. It's really tiny. I can't, I can't see it. <laughs> so, yeah, I can see a swivel. So it really helps me. If I had to tie on a, a finesse bait every single time, um, it would take me 10 minutes. <laughs> I'm pretty sure. So popping this thing on and off for my finesse, it works really, really well. It's great for jigs. It's great for anything subsurface. I like using swivels. I know a lot of fishermen... They don't like using, they think I'm a child. Well, I am in touch with my child within. But I'm also blind as a bat. And I like these a lot. So if you're ever wondering, should you buy swivels? Only buy this type. With that little bit of hook. So it goes ahead and grabs that. Um, and then they come in different sizes, different pound strengths, things like that. So I use them for my finesse almost exclusively. So my my heavier rods, I tie my, I do a lot of, you know, top water with them. Uh, my swim baits, I don't want them sw swiveling. Why would I use them for that anyway? I can, much bigger line, it's 30 pound test. I can see it. So anyway, that is today's little tip. Now let's go back to this really cool animated intro that I animated, and I think it's turned out pretty cool. Take care, everybody.